My standard post-intubation positioning is to have the head of bed up 30 degrees in the semi-recumbent position. In this positioning, we take the weight of the chest wall off of the lungs, which allows the alveoli to stay open, stay recruited, and stay involved in gas exchange. But in obese patients, the semi-recumbent position is actually harmful. I wanna give a big shout out to Steve Haywood for teaching me all about this. In that semi-recumbent position, the abdominal girth is pushed up into the diaphragm, and that leads to more compression of the lungs. Flat is actually better than 30 degrees head of bed up, as shown in this 2024 study. But even better is reverse Trendelenburg. This study in 2020 showed that the reverse Trendelenburg position leads to better respiratory mechanics when compared to other positioning. Obviously, it can be challenging to keep patients in the reverse Trendelenburg position, but based on the data we have, it seems to be truly advantageous to improve respiratory mechanics, which can lead to better outcomes for our patients. So once you intubate an obese patient, go for reverse Trendelenburg. If you can't achieve that, keep them flat. Both of those positions are gonna be better than semi-recumbent.